In this instructional video, we will show you how to create a worm pick and how to use it to move the model organism to see elegance from plate to plate. Creating the worm pick. Materials needed are platinum wire, glass rod, matches, Bunsen burner, gloves, forceps, and tweezers. First begin lighting the Bunsen burner with your matches. Then put on your gloves. After you have put on your gloves, grab your glass rod with your forceps and begin to heat. Continue heating the glass rod until the hole begins to close. Then get your lab partner to grab onto the platinum wire with tweezers and place into the closing hole. Then continue heating. To close the hole in the glass rod, get your lab partner to slowly pinch the glass over the, over the fire. The glass should fold on itself, bonding the platinum wire to the glass rod. After your pick is cooled, begin shaving the edge with a sharp edged razor. Shave the edge until both sides are flat and be careful not to cut the platinum wire or your fingers. Step two, picking the C. elegans worm. What you will need, a pair of gloves, two petri dishes, a set of matches, and a dissecting microscope. And don't forget your freshly made worm pick. At this point, flame your worm pick. It cools down very fast. At this stage, make sure you do not stab the worm. Gently find the worm of your choice and tap it with the worm pick. This is how the worm appears under the microscope. Once you have picked the worm with your worm pick, place it on a petri dish with a food sauce. Please do not get upset or discouraged if you cannot pick the worm. This takes practice. Always make sure your lab partner checks to see if the worm is on the plate. Now that's a good job done. Let's tie it. Tell your friends.